learning more about Clean Green Bin Service. Luke Rogers with us this morning. Good morning, morning. Luke. How are you? I, uh, I'm great. Uh, what a good idea. So, can you explain the service to me? Uh, basically, we're trying to help residents want to use their bin a little bit more. I yeah. Mean, you can tell just by looking at this one that Let's it's. Uh, take a it's look seen in there. Many better days. <laughs> Uh, and that's typical. You know what? It's funny because this is not an extreme case. No. That is not unlike my green bin at home. And you know, when, when they've rolled up the green bin, it was a great idea. You're talking about composting. They said that it would seal and stop bugs. I find that to not be true. There's no rubber seal, so you can't seal it 100%. Fruit uh, flies are an issue oh, in my home, and it's because of a dirty green bin, right? Yeah, it's, uh, well, it's one of those things. They find a place where there's fruits and vegetables, and well, you, you got them. They're, they're not leaving. There you go. Uh, we, we know that raccoons are able to open these things with their crafty little hands, but uh, keeping it clean is a major chore. It's a yeah. major chore for me to do at home. Like so, if I'm gonna keep it clean, I would have to either throw bleach or a, a detergent into it, use my hose, that's going into the sewer system. You've got a better solution. Uh, basically, our, our, our system is, is that we use, well, eco-friendly soaps, yeah, detergents. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice peace of mind. And hot water and, and a lot of pressure. So it pretty much removes everything and then it gets filtered uh, before it actually gets recycled through three more filters in the back and then put back into the, the wastewater. So we wash with wastewater and then we rinse with clean water. So. This is pretty state of the art. I know it's pretty loud, but I'd love to have a look inside. Sure. Let's have a look and see how it works. All right. So that is the, uh, what I'm seeing is a plexiglass unit. Yeah. And well, let's see it rather than you talk about it. it? Yeah. All right. So the bin's already been pre-soaked for you. Okay. Normally I'd spray the detergent inside and then put it inside and rinse it. So it's okay. pre-soaked for time. And yeah. See how that works. He heads inside. So there we are, uh, pressure washing the exterior of the green bin. It's very nice. Uh, high pressure, obviously, and really getting that spick and span on the outside. But it's the inside that is extra nasty. So uh, by the time this is done, we expect it to be pretty spick and span. And I can't tell you how that green bin smelled while I was looking at it. Uh, <laughs> if we had smell vision, you would definitely not be happy. That's for sure. All right, Luke, so that's... So that's been sprayed, and now... Now I'll flip it upside down. Okay. Let the inside do it. All right, we'll flip it upside down. Here we go. Get it in position. Get it locked up and ready to rock. So, so if you can see in here, that's that's serious pressure. Yeah. Huh? At 3,500 psi, at uh, 200 degree Fahrenheit. Okay, so yeah. there's nothing left behind no, it's, it's done there. If it can't remove it, it's not meant to be removed. <laughs> if it can't remove it, that's a permanent fixture on the green yeah. bin. Oh, right? yeah. Okay. And uh, so 200 degrees, and I was I was saying that you, the smell of that green bin yeah. was not something you could translate in television. It's it, just not pleasant. You, you wish that there was smell of vision once in a while <laughs> so that you could actually smell some of yeah. these things. The other thing is that this is nice for the, uh, the folks who are handling yeah. these green bins. This is just a conscientious thing to do. Well, it's, it's one of those things, right? You, you drag it up to your curb if you're running late. Now you've grabbed the handle, which has got all the stuff inside. Now you've touched your steering wheel, yeah. your work phone. It, 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 everything's just being dragged everywhere. So. And I can only imagine the bacteria that uh, is moving through. How long does this take? Uh, depending on how dirty the bin is, usually about five minutes. Okay. Uh, if it's really dirty, then I'll usually soak it again. Okay. So it's about 10 minutes. But for the most part, it's about five minutes. So five minutes and you'll come to my door to do it? Right to your door. Isn't that amazing? Uh, if people want to find out more, I think it's right on the side of the truck. Clean-green-services. Yeah. You sign up. You can either sign up on the store there. Uh, you can find out. We've tested a bunch of bins. and. And yeah, that's oh, makes good. life easy. Uh, if this could have taken another couple of minutes, maybe we'll take a look at it after the yeah, fact yeah. And, uh, and maybe get a little sure. shot of that uh, a little later on on the show.